I would not be the same person if I did not have my second language, in this case English, or my first language Spanish. Uh, to me that makes who I am as a person, as a human being. Provides me with tremendous access to the memories of my family. Imagine, you know, if I, if I did not have access to the memories of my grandma or to my grandfather, if I could not talk to my uncles in, the, uh, in Spanish, I would be very poor in, as a person. Uh, and so to me, it's very important, it's crucial, it's, it's essential that children maintain you know, their family language, that they're able to connect with their parents, with their grandparents, with their family, so they can have access to memories and to wisdoms that they will never learn from books. And also for other children to learn a second language so that they can establish friendships with other human beings. They can see how people feel about certain things. You know, I teach at the university level, and let me tell you, I think a lot of children come to me, a lot of students said, you know, I'm very happy, very glad that I learned a second language when I was a child. So I will say to children, it's probably the most important investment that you will do to keep your language or learn a second language. And children are the masters. Uh, they are the master learners. They're the ones that learn, you know, like natives, the second language. And I think uh, there's not better investment for the United States to invest on second language, you know, uh, learning experiences for children. And so they can be the ambassadors. And I think uh, here we are, you know, there are three, mil three billion human beings. And yes, English is spoken by a lot of people, but there are a lot of languages you know, that we need to maintain, that we need to keep. And I think they're part of the, the human, uh, I think the tremendous, the treasure of who we are as human beings.